Hey, how's it going everybody? This is Lucas with N4BB.com. I'm going to show you a software run through on the new BlackBerry Q5. If you looked at our BlackBerry Q10 or even the Z10 review, uh, then you are already very familiar with BlackBerry 10. Uh, and it's very, very familiar on the BlackBerry Q5 as it is on the Q10. Um, so the Q5, at least for us, came pre-bundled with uh, OS 10.1.0.2342 which is not far off from what's available today um, so pretty much uh, the only thing you'll notice on this QWERTY device is the uh, majority of the settings and whatnot are uh, in white because this features an LCD screen whereas the Q10 featured an OLED and so this can't take uh, advantage of the uh, the black theme it wouldn't won't serve any purpose um, but yeah I mean the you know everything's half the size of what it is on a blackberry Z10 so you can see it's instead of four icon columns it's uh, three so just like the the Q10 and um, the screen is about the same vibrance. Um, let's lighten it up. So I've got both the same brightness. Whereas the Q10, which you know features an OLED, same with the Dev Alpha here, which is dead. Oh, great! <laughs> uh, but yeah, you you notice the color uh, isn't quite as um, some people say whitewashed but it's definitely not as vibrant uh, as these but yeah in the software you've got all the same apps uh, the cool thing about BlackBerry 10 is that the apps are very scalable so if you make an app for uh, the Z10 it can easily be uh, converted for the Q5 almost right away without any type of uh, ad additional uh, changing to it so that's nice um, but it's got all the same, all the same features. Everything is just half the uh, the size of it is on the Z10. It's only a 3.1 inch screen. But um, yeah, I mean BlackBerry 10 is really great. It's, you can see just how fast and fluid it is, even on uh, this, which features a smaller processor. Um, but it's still got the two gigs RAM, so. It, it allows the OS just to be blazing fast, and that's what you want. You know, it's a it's an entry level device, but there's really no hang ups uh, for this phone. So you get the power of BlackBerry 10 for pretty much half the cost of the Q10. So, and if you just don't mind the the uh, the curve styled keyboard, then it's a win win. You know, and it's got the LCD screen. Uh, the battery, of course, uh, is in it so you can't take it out it's a non-removable battery um, but it is 2800 milliamps so uh, you get great battery life for it um, but yeah not, not really much else to say about BlackBerry 10 because you've probably already seen what we've talked about it before when we first dissected it when it first came out but uh, it's definitely an excellent entry-level device I actually kind of like it um, you know most people are like why we don't, we, we don't need this device blah blah, blah. But uh, it's definitely a great, great little device for uh, for entry level market, and it'll be coupled well with the new BlackBerry Seven device that's coming out for the emerging market. So, but yeah, BlackBerry Q5, pretty cool stuff. Thanks for watching.